Yo, what's going on guys? Simply Pops here and today is finally the day that we can jailbreak iOS 10.2, man. Definitely, man. I can't wait for this. And having stock iOS is a little boring and the jailbreak, man, once you go jailbreak, it's, it's going to be hard for you to go back. So, um, you know, thank you guys so much for 6,149 subscribers. I love you guys for that. Um, I'm sure you guys how to jailbreak iOS 10.2. Um, by the way, Apple stopped signing iOS 10.1.1. So, uh, you know, you, you pretty much asked out at this point. And by the way, guys, you are going to need a computer this time around. I know it's not as good as the last jailbreak, which was 9.3.3 where you could do it on your phone that was pretty impressive but it is what it is at least we have in a jailbreak and before i even move on i want to give a quick shout out to luca salute to him man for making this jailbreak you're a genius first things first if you want a jailbreak now you have to go to this site now um shout out to luca first thing first thing i saw man fuck <laughs> i crack your device like when you have the stuff in the description like it take you to some ad site all right, so you're gonna need the IPA, which is um, Yahoo, all right? You're gonna need that, and you're gonna need Cydia Impactor. So I'm gonna throw this in the description. Cydia Impactor is down here. The IPA for the jailbreak is up here. So once you download those two, um, it's gonna take you to this site. You download it for the Mac. If you're on Windows, you download it for Windows. All you gotta do, um, if you're on Mac, you just simply click and drag it to your applications folder. I already did that already. But um, yeah, so this is how easy it is to jailbreak, man. Um, once you have the Yalu IPA file, all you gotta do is click and drag it. Oops. You click and drag it to the City of Impactor. You type in your iTunes email address. Now basically that's your Apple ID. This is safe. This is encrypted straight through Apple. This is not, um, you know, this is not sharing information. This is totally safe. And now if you get something like this, I know a lot of people are gonna get this. You have to go down to Apple and you're gonna have to get your um, app Pacific password. So I'm gonna get that password. I can't show you guys, obviously, because I know a lot of people are new to jailbreaking. So you're gonna get something like this. So I wanna guide you guys. Pretty self-explanatory as it was too much stuff to censor. So I didn't wanna show you guys all of that, all right? And for your password, all you gotta do, you take that app Pacific password and you just paste it onto this. If it can paste, there we go. And it should be able to work. And then what it's gonna do is, um, you allow this, or if you on Windows, you accept any prompts or alerts. And all it is is signing the IPA file for the Yahoo jailbreak. And what basically what you're gonna have to do, I'm not talking to you, Siri, down here. That's the Yahoo jailbreak. And yeah, you're done using the computer. All you gotta do now, you can put this away. Every seven days, you will have to um, repeat the same process, but it's so easy. It takes like about it takes like about a minute and that's it. Um, it could be annoyance, but hey man, at least you have a jailbreak. So all you gotta do, you launch the Yalu jailbreak. Oh, before you, keep on forgetting, before you do all of that, you will have to, um, you know, accept the, accept the app. So, all right, so I went to settings, general, device management, tap on your email and just tap on trust. That's it. It's trusting. You go back to the home, you tap on it, and there you go, man. Now, I was going to say it may slow down your device. You know, I, I ain't nothing to worry about, man. Nothing to worry about. If anything, they update the app, you can do the same process again. I'll update the description. You guys check up on the site. So, all you got to do is simply tap on go. And now, it's jailbreaking your device. Now, back in the days, we had to put our device on airplane mode, turn on find my iPhone. Those are the classic legendary days of jailbreaking. Now we get into a point where we got to sign IPAs, um, you know, like it's just so much new stuff going on with the jailbreak scene. But like I said, I'm happy that we having a jailbreak today. Thank you, Luca. I think it might fail. If it failed for the first time, it's okay. Just keep on trying it. It will work. <laughs> there you guys have it I should be I should have Cydia somewhere okay there we have it Cydia is right there ladies and gentlemen thank you so much Luca oh man without this man oh man ah oh, man we get, we're not gonna be jailbroken for a very long time and salute to Luca man I throw his Twitter in the description or something I gotta give him some credit man 
And of course, we're gonna have the same message as last time. City may slow down your iPhone, but trust me, I've been jailbroken for X amount of years. And man, it's good to have City here, man. You guys can see I'm on 10.2. This is the iPhone 6 Plus. Don't worry, I'm gonna upgrade to that iPhone 8 this year. I can't wait for that. And let City load, man. So yeah, so there you guys have it, and I'm gonna show you guys why you should jailbreak, and these are the tweaks that I normally like to install. Um, I like to install iCleaner, I heard it just been supported for iOS 10. When you're not jailbroken, you just feel so limited. Like, I can change my icons, I can change the font, I can supercharge my Instagram app, my Snapchat app, um, my Twitter, anything that you can name up, I can supercharge it. Like, jailbreaking is, is basically changed the way how you use your phone, man, definitely. Um, and I can speed up the animations if I want. Jailbreaking is basically life, man. And I know I'm, I know I'm sounding like a nerd for saying that, but it really is life, man. Because it definitely do help me out with certain situations. Um, if this is not working, I can download a tweak real quick and I, and I can make it work. And when I mean possibilities are endless, I really do mean that. So I installed a couple of tweaks. So I have the CC power. So enable low power mode on your control center. Nice little touch over there. Um, CC record or C record, something like that. Boom. If I tap on it, it's recording my screen right now. Tap on it again, it'll stop recording. I can enable dark mode if I like. Very, very nice. I love it, man. So, yeah, man, I installed iCleaner, of course. Gotta install this, especially if you're jailbroken. Me go. Alexa, stop. Finally finish. Took a long time. One gigabyte. And I was on iOS 9. It's a good thing I it's a good thing I updated quick. A lot of people tell me to wait. You're already jailbroken, but now you're getting all the good features, all the new tweaks. And that's what it's about, man. Getting those new features and everything. So it was worth it, man. It was worth the wait. And I'm happy I did it. So alrighty guys, so I decided to show you guys me jailbreaking my iPad Pro um, 9.7 inch why not I'll do it on camera for you guys real quick so just going over everything you click and drag the Yahoo jailbreak API type in your Apple ID City Impact you're done you're gonna have the Yahoo jailbreak once you tap on that okay obviously you're gonna have to trust it trust then now you can Okay, may you slow down, you tap on go. Okay, if it fails, it's okay. You click retry and see it, it didn't it didn't install Cydia, so good. Tap on go again. Once you see that, you in the golden, you're pretty much good. At this point, you're gonna have Cydia nine times out of ten. And there you guys have it. Cydia is right there. You can tap on it, you're jailbroken. And that's it, man. So easy. I do believe that the iPad is good enough, too, because you have split. Yeah, you know, you can run two apps at once. I'm surprised the Yahoo have a side-by-side -side mode, too, as well. But I recommend everybody to jailbreak. iOS is good, but jailbreaking it only adds the cherry on top. So, uh, yeah, so hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, appreciate it with a thumbs up. Comment down below if you have any questions. Other than that, your boy Pops. And I'll catch you guys on my next video.